two people who can tell me about this issue. I want to fight this thing by prayer. Let me hear, my sister. Another one is here. Can you just tell me? Apostle, I need approximately in my bank account 25,000 a month just to pay my debts. That's not to leave, just to pay the debts, business debts and my own debts. I need that in my account every month. If I don't have that, then I'm in areas. Like now, already I'm in areas. You're in areas now. Yes, Apostle. Huh? That's why I'm here now. That's I don't why you're know. here. I'm not managing. You're not managing. I'm not. You're paying what? I'm paying, it's a business debt combined with my own debts. I, I own a property, but I have to pay uh, rates and tax. I'm 15, on 15,000. I think they're going to take me to the lawyers now. Okay, because just... I have to make my business to survive every month. So I'm taking all the money to the business. Put your hands on your chest. Well, thank you, Lord. Make an example of canceling these debts. <laughs> In the name of Jesus. Let me hear. It's tough, Daddy. Um, my husband is forced to work because um, we are paying the house and our kids' school fees. And for us to eat for the whole month, we have to borrow. And month end, we have to pay that debt again for the grocery, for the petrol, and the car we are also paying. Everything we borrow. Listen to this. You can't live without debt now because you're the one who's starting a generation. No one pass inheritance to you. I'm sure you understand that. For example, the house you are paying is for your generation. So when the children come to stay there, they won't pay for that house. But you are starting, so you need God's favor to cancel this thing. And then uh, I believe it will happen. Amen. In I Jesus' name. It. Take it. it. And then uh, let me get the last person. I saw my brother. Daddy, I'm owing a lot of money. Yes. I'm earning 10,000, but I left with 10,000. You say, I didn't hear you. I'm earning 10,000 every month, but uh, now I left with 2,000, and I yeah. didn't offer. Yeah, you pastors of Charis, you people, please, let's pray for this. This is a very, I mean, a weapon of Satan. In fact, to affect even our church. So, because if now this man is left with 3,000, look at the whole month. How much is given to church? How much is given to the world? You are paying what? I'm paying car... And there's another, this small one, this cool fit. Listen to this. Another thing is, don't feel bad that you are paying car. You understand? Amen. Because you need a car to go to that work. Amen. Because most of the time you find that you have to buy a car and you don't have enough. You buy it, you want to go to the work there. And that car takes more money now. What about petrol? What about, I'm sure you understand that. Amen. If not, you won't reach your work. But we need, you know, financial breakthrough to cancel this thing. Jesus. In Jesus' name. Take it. You are blessed. What I'm paying is I'm paying a card of something that I didn't do. And the worst part is I'm not even working. I'm doing leadership. I have to pay them a thousand rand every month for that money. Well, you are paying, uh, what is that? In 2015, what happened was I was working at a store and I was working as the cash of a slack. What happened was my password got stolen and then an amount of 55,000 got lost. So what happened was they took me to court and then the court said that I must pay the money back because then that is my negligent. I want to pray for you, but let's, let's have the truth here first. Mm. What happened? Can you explain which is the truth? What happened? 
Okay, what happened was I was working as the cash office clerk, and then I had to go and relieve someone at the liquor store. And then what happened was uh, there were transactions that happened, and then on that tran those transactions that happened, it was uh, my password that used those transactions, that, that happened with all those transactions, and then it was on numerous accounts. You mean you don't know anything about that transaction? No, I don't. Mean when you God. come back, you find that someone used your to take the money. That's what you're saying. Yes, that is exactly what happened. Come, let me pray for you. God loves you. So automatically, you could see a situation like this. Now, for how long you're supposed to pay? I started paying the money in 2015 August. They chase you out of the work or you're still working there? I'm not working. You can hear that. This is how Satan cage our people. This is how Satan... You people, when I say it's troubling me, this thing, you know, you can't save money. You are, I mean, and there's too much responsibility. Is it true? Stop crying. So where is your boyfriend? Is that work? What is he saying about that? What happened, my boyfriend is the, mother, is the father of my kids. What happened that time when I was busy with everything on the court, he left me. And then now he came back recently. Why, when he came back, he said what? Well, when he comes back, he just said that he wanted his family back and then he's coming back to apologize. Yeah. So you are staying with him? Yeah, I am. So, where is he now? He's at work. Does he come to church? He you doesn't. Hear, you can hear this issue. Sometimes you find this, she agreed this because of frustration. And that is true, man of God. Huh? That is true. Because at the end of the day, there's no money. And there's a baby of this man. And who's going to group this baby? So, because I was seeing her like, she took time to take decision, to agree on that. That is true, man huh? of God. He started... Last, it was last year when he started calling me, telling me that he wanted to come back. Touch your chest in Jesus' name. Tell him I want to see him. Okay, man of God. Eh? I'll do that. And uh, please allow me to come see me with this brother. Because there's a Lord. God loves you again. Thank you, man Can of I God. Can I get the last person? Huh? Okay. <laughs> I also need the grace for debt cancellations. Huh? I also need the grace for debt cancellations. When I was speaking with that lady, I, I felt strange. You see me coming in the air. You saw me coming here. Where's the lady? That lady that I was speaking with. When I was speaking with you, I felt so strange. You understand? Mm -hmm. I have to move from here to come here just to find out what is happening with you. You hear me? Okay. Yeah? So I believe God is going to deliver you. And I have just lost my leadership, man of God, because of the anger that I have. I fought with the manager. I can't hear. I've just lost my leadership, the leadership that I was doing. Because of all the frustrations and the anger that I have in me, I yes. fought with the manager. That's why I said, hey, I feel stray, but because it's as if after I spoke with you, still your answers are not, are not there. You don't feel satisfied. But you are just encouraged to say, I said you must bring the brother. Okay, yeah. man of God. So, I believe God loves you. Encourage yourself from today. Uh, myself, I need 20,900 every month for, de for debits, taxes, rates, levies, and utilities. That's exclusive food, uh, petrol, money, and other so, things. 
Okay, my sister, before you finish, I believe all of us will go challenges now. Eh? Because this, you know, it's like I'm trying to open up the wound. When you're listening, you could see everybody's sad about what is happening, including my sister already, but God is touching her here already. So let it happen in Jesus' name. Let her have a testimony. It will happen in Jesus' name. Amen. You are free.